Uh, this is Dave from CheapBooks.com. I am playing World of Tanks. The tank I am playing is the French Sarl 42. It's a Tier 4 tank. I believe it's a medium tank. And uh, the map is Murovanka. As you can see, this is an encounter map. It looks like most of my team is actually heading towards the encounter area. Which is good. That's what you want to do. You want to fight the battle, but you want to stay close to the cap so you can defend it or invade if you have to. Um, because uh, this this tank does better if you get the higher level engine. You really want to get the higher level engine with uh, a lot of tanks, especially the French tanks. It's very important to have a good engine so you can chase down enemy tanks. So most of our uh, tanks are in a good fighting position. And I am moving into a different position because I don't follow everybody. hand just went berserk. For some reason, I had this major twitch with my hand. I don't know what that was all about. So I missed my first shot. My, like I said, I had this major muscle spasm. It's really weird. Never had that happen before. Uh, but you can see the results of it on the screen, that's for sure. It happened again, it happened again. It wasn't so bad though. So there's something weird going on. Oh, my other hand is doing it too now. <laughs> ah, stop! My hands are going crazy for some reason. That's like I've lost control. He loses control. Yeah, my hand has serious problems right now. They're making it difficult to play the game. Penetration. Penetration. Oh. For Everyone get out. Okay, so um, I got a lot of good shots in. It was a little bit of a crazy game for me. I'm just cleaning my mouse right now. That's what happens when you clean your mouse. Uh, but my hands are twitching, and unfortunately, it puts me at a huge disadvantage. Um, I'm, I'm having problems aiming. and uh, Okay, so um, hopefully we'll have a victory here. Let's see how this plays out. Got one more tank left. Get the Covenanter. Okay, how did we do?
Came up number three for EXP, which is pretty good. I think I could have done a little bit better. I, I had a little a couple of problems. I I missed my first shot on the Valentine. Um, I missed some key shots on those tanks that were a little bit far. Um, as I've said before, if you want to be in the top two or three, you need to get at least ten penetrations. Or have uh, damage caused with your assistance be equal to a penetration. So that shows you that that rule still holds. Um, anything interesting here? I injured a loader. Ammo rack. Okay, so that is a Sarl 42. Let's see what we can get over here. I, in order to upgrade, you got to get this G1R. And as you can see, I've already got a lot of uh, stuff upgraded. Um, this engine does not work with the G1R. What about this? That doesn't either. Um, I'm going to upgrade into here. Let's see if this uses the G... If This does not work with the G1R. And neither does that. I'm looking under compatible vehicles over here. And as you can see, they don't work with this tank. What about this one? Nope. So a lot of this equipment is not going to work with the tank after it. But you'll notice that a lot of it works, for example, the engine works with the Somua, which is the tank before it. So one of the things you can do is you can, when you play this tank, keep it before you, when you finish playing this tank, you buy the Sarl 42, but keep the Somua S35. Don't sell it yet. And then what you do is when you play for the double victory, the double experience or the triple, uh, today we have triple. If you look over here, you'll see I get triple for each victory. So what you do is you keep that tank, the Somua, and you play it to get that triple. And with that triple, you could buy this engine. And with that engine, you can use it with this tank. So you can also use this to get these radios. You can play the Somua S35, get the triple victory, uh, get some of these radios like the ER27. You'll see it also works with the Sarl 42. Um, and of course you could do it with this other tank, this Renault G1. Let's see where the G1 is. The G1. Where's, where's the Renault G1? I don't see a Renault G1 anywhere. Is it Renault G1? I wonder if... With this... Renault G1. It says it right here, Renault G1. But I don't see it over here. It's not those, it's not that, it's not that, it's not that, it's not that. There's a G1R. Oh, okay. So you'll see here it says G Renault G1, but over here it says G1R. So apparently that's the same tank. So you can share some of the equipment. Uh, as an example, I have the Sarl. And uh, this radio works with the G1R, this radio here. Uh, maybe these guns do too. Yes, I suppose they do. So what you can do is, when I get the 13,000, I could keep this tank an extra day. Play to get the double victory, and if I get 2,000, I could get, you know, an engine and a radio. And keep on playing for those victories, and use it to help equip this tank. So he doesn't have to, well, it looks like he's already got that engine. The tracks probably are not going to be on the lower tank. But things like the engine and the radio and the guns usually are. Uh, so that's one of the little tricks you can use. If you have any questions, please post them below.